that's what I'm wanting. Even though the grain's pretty on the others, that's the one I'm looking for. All right. <laughs>
getting to the last step, there is something I want to share with you guys. There might be a lot of question if you're not real familiar with it. This is my process, okay? So I take a block of the same width, put it under this corner, and I line these up just as exact as I can get them. All right, corner to the outside corner matching. If, if anything, just a hair line of light, if you can barely see that, okay? I'm gonna come over here to this corner, clamped flush, even with this here, right? I'm under here, and I make the mark. Flip this over, put this up in here, And voila. Okay, we're gonna knock out some of the sanding here. We've got our 220 on, knock down some of the glue spots real quick. And then we're gonna go to our 500 and hit the rest of it. And then we're gonna get some uh, Danish oil on this. And then we're gonna uh, put some poly.
Okay, so we've got our drawers out here and we're fixing to go ahead and put the poly on them. They're dried enough and I've wiped them down so we're in good shape. Went ahead and cleaned up all the rails to get any residue of the Danish oil off of these so that didn't dry sticky because uh, it did leave a little coating on it. So I went ahead and got all those cleaned up. So we're ready to go on this. We're going to move forward and put this poly on here real quick. Okay, we've got this sanded down really good. I'm going to take some denatured alcohol. And I'm just going to wipe this real lightly and clean all this sanding dust off. And there we go. They are in. Anyway, that's the conclusion on the pantry. We appreciate you guys tuning in. We hope that everybody has enjoyed this segment on the pantry build. And uh, you guys continue to tune in. Thank you for all the followers, all the viewers, subscribers. We. I'm being told something. Hang on. What? The light is halo in your head. Oh. Well, you know, I gotta have some sort of light. <laughs> Go over there to this point. That's better. Okay. Anyway, so as I was saying, we hope that you guys uh, enjoy this and uh, come back and join us when we get our next project going. I've got a lot of things on the list to do. I've got a rain catch that we're gonna put out in the back. Already have the barrels, we're gonna build the frame for it get that set it up and plumbed gonna get back to the welding cart i keep promising everybody i'm gonna do that and that's on the list to do anyway, real quick thanks everybody for tuning in we hope you guys have enjoyed it again and uh be kind to everybody and y'all take care we'll see you later